Hey guys, how you doing? Uncle Bob Connor here with another DVD, uh, sorry, with another video. And today we're actually going to be looking at almost 20 of the top action, horror, or family DVDs of 2021. It took me quite a while to get them all together. Uh, gradually got them you know not all in once um to get them but finally got them actually and uh yeah gonna get straight onto it and go through all the dvds which ones there are because there's almost 20 here as well as venom in no particular order um let there be carnage obviously the second one then um suicide squad next one and Ghostbusters Afterlife next installment into the Ghostbusters uh, franchise then it's Adam's Family 2 obviously the animated one that they did second one then we've got Godzilla vs Kong obviously the next one in the Godzilla franchise then we've got G.I. Joe Origins, Snake Eyes, which is pretty good, and the uh, G.I. Joe franchise, and then they've got the Hitman's Wife's Bodyguard, which is the next one from obviously Hitman's Bodyguard, then we've got Matrix Resurrections, obviously the next instalment into the Matrix franchise, then we've got James Bond, No Time to Die, next instalment into the James Bond franchise, and then we've got the Mortal Kombat film, the new one obviously into the franchise, then we've got Shang-Chi, Legend of the Ten Rings, I think it's how you say it, is it Shang-Chi is it, Shang-Chi, um, well you know what it is anyway. Legend of the Ten Rings, really enjoyable movie. Pretty enjoyable all the way through, actually. It's pretty much uh, for an, almost a two hour film all along. It's pretty much a lot of action. Not really much talking. It's quite good, actually. Seen it a couple of times, really good. Then we've got Wrong Turn, horror film. Next installment, well, say next installment, but it's not really nothing to do with the other Wrong Turns. It's pretty much a sort of like a reboot. It's actually okay, actually. Uh, but I prefer the other ones, you know, in the franchise. Anyway, then we've got the Candyman, the, obviously the newest one into the, sorry about that light coming in, by the way. I thought it'd be too dark without. Anyway, Candyman, obviously, in the next franchise. Um, then we've got Black Widow, Marvel, which is not, uh, you know, there's not the second one. Then we've got Spider-Man, No Way Home, which is obviously in the franchise. Then we've got The Purge. Forever Purge, I've seen the Purge trend tries. Then we've got Space Jam, New Legacy, Halloween Kills, obviously in the new trilogy. And then finally we've got Fast and Furious 9, obviously in Fast Furious trilogy, really, really good. Very enjoyable, a lot of good action. That light's pretty annoying. Um, as I say, I thought it would be too dark without. 